Some people living in an Atomas neighborhood may soon be getting an unexpected check in the mail. I'm surprised because I never heard of it. Well, neither had we. It's very rare that we have a story like this, but the city of Sacramento has money that it now wants to give back. Mm, tonight we're getting answers to the question, where is that cash coming from? Thanks for the good news. <laughs> Dan Ferales is one of 14,000 Sacramento residents that may soon be getting some surprise money in the mail. I was surprised because this is the first time I've heard about it. It's great. Good news. We didn't even know that there's money coming. If approved by the city council next week, many North Natomas homeowners will be getting cash back. So just how much will each homeowner get? Non-corner lots are eligible to receive $100 and the corner lots are $200. $200 is something we can spend wisely. Well, that's going to help out on paying the mortgage. <laughs> so where is this cash coming from? Back in the 2000s, developers in North Natomas were required to pay for planting trees as new homes were being built. The city still has nearly $1.7 million left. And we had no more real good space to plant more trees because the home builders did such a nice job. So now all of those homeowners are eligible for those refunds. So what can the money be spent on? Inevitably, it's their money to do what they want. But because of the drought, people are being encouraged to spend some money on making their homes more water efficient. We'd be more than happy to oblige with that and look at more drought resistant plants. Homeowners happy to be getting a little extra green just in time for spring. I'm a little skeptical that I'm going to get a check in the mail with no strings attached, but I, I will await that and be very happy when I do. <laughs> So you, how can you find out if your house is eligible for that cash back? We posted the entire list on our website, cbs13.com.